Okay. Village Town Center. Hurricane. What is... I don't remember. A hurricane was, has landed. Watch for the ever-changing winds. I have never seen this battle type before. This is gonna be interesting. Alright, it's just a regular showdown, so... Oh, I see. Wind blowing. So you gotta watch your footing. Alright, I didn't even- I wasn't involved in that. That just kinda happened. Hey! Guys, Zach Mars here, and welcome back to Shovel Light Showdown. So, this time we're going to be playing as one of the mooks. One of the classic enemies that we can play as. Um, there's only two of them, but we can play as them. So, we're starting with Gold Armor. Gold Armor is gonna be interesting, because he's Gold Armor. He's got a shield, he's got a sword, he's got, apparently got all of his abilities that, from all of his other different forms, so we'll see how he goes. Um, easy mode, as per usual, because I'm not very good at this game. I tried it on hard once, and that did not pan out well. I was not well at the Tower of Fate. A terrible truth had been revealed. Okay. Spectre Knight stormed off, filled with rage at the Enchantress. Their final battle was imminent. The residents of the Tower gathered. They boldly decided to rebel and help their friend. Hastily, they hatched a plan to modify the magic mirror. Perhaps they could trap the Enchantress and Shide. With their preparations complete, the Ramshackle contraption sprang to life. But something went terribly wrong! And I already know he's not in it, since he's a basic enemy. It, gold armors would not would never be in this. They are the basic enemy and the most recurring enemy in the game. They're not necessarily a mascot, but they're the enemy people will most remember. One foot in front of the other. Gold armor marched, but had the cobbles of pride more vanished beneath him? Gold Armor gazed around and, admiring the large arena, remembered his training. He raised the shield, spying out threats on their horizon. Alright. Um, seems Treasure Knight is our story piece for this. Alright, let's see how Gold Armor actually plays. I'm interested because he's got a lot of tools at his disposal, apparently. So, let's go. Oh, I see. I see. I see. That's how he's able to guard. He holds it. He holds his weapon, but uh, but uh, but he loses a lot of maneuverability if he does that. Alright, he's alright fun to play as, I can tell you that much. Alright. He's a lot better, he's a lot more fun than I thought he was going to be. I'll tell you that.
side. Shovel Knight's playing a little more aggressively now, so we gotta be steer clear of him. Ow. We all, but we both died. All right, that was easy. <laughs> oh, and he gets his king, and he gets the king knife theme. Okay. Uh, actually, that makes sense considering they're the they're the primary drugs for the, the um for the royal. They're the primary drugs for the royal guard, so it makes sense that they would actually get the king knife theme, considering they kind of work under him up until the then some shovel of hope. So, yeah, that makes it that makes a bit of sense. All right, but in any case, it is it appears to be a ladies' night. We're apparently going to have to fight, um, the enchantress and Mona. Ow! Well, they're playing aggressively, and I'm playing like an idiot. I can bounce too. I didn't realize I could bounce. Alright, well, the Enchantress is dead. So all that's left is Mona. <laughs> what did she get hit with? Oh, I, I didn't realize I picked up a Phoenix. I didn't realize I picked up a Griffin, so. Oh, there he is! King Knight, Your Majesty! Oh, it's just another gold armor. Make yourself useful and find us a way out of here, eh? But, but I was going to ask if you knew a way out. Perhaps we could work together? Work? Me? With you? Oh, that wouldn't do it all. Can't be fraternizing with the help now. But you may toil in my service and get us out of here like a good minion. Hmm. Yes, sir. Aw. Poor guy. Yeah, the, their, their dynamic is a little bit, uh, off. They're, it's, they're not fun. What does gold armor unlock? What does he unlock? Thank you for picking up the gem for me. Playing a little aggressively, too aggressively for my liking. Yeah. Going to, this isn't ending. This isn't going to end well. King Knight, it doesn't help that King Knight isn't really helping, which is opposed to the whole point. Notches. All right, they only, they only need to get. I'm out of continues. I wasn't paying attention to what my continues were.
All right. Yeah. Figured that was going to happen. That's why Death are screwing around and not doing anything. This isn't working. This is dark. This is rough. Okay, I only need one more. There we go. Yeah, I just need to concentrate there. Nothing to it. All right, now Plague Knight. With an interesting assortment. Okay. Village Town Center. Hurricane. What is... I don't know. A hurricane was, has landed. Watch for the ever-changing winds. I have never seen this battle type before. This is gonna be interesting. Alright, it's just a regular showdown, so... Oh, I see. Wind blowing. So you gotta watch your footing. I didn't even- I wasn't involved in that. That just kinda happened. Alright. 
And now it's time for my favorite game, your favorite game, everybody's favorite game. Hi, Percy. Everybody loves everybody loves the target minigame, right? Right? Right. Everybody loves it. Doesn't seem like it seems like I don't go off the edge. That's good. that's an, unless as long as I'm standing, that is. Should have died there. I didn't, but I should have. Okay. I'm not doing very good, but I'm doing okay. I want to say I'm doing okay. That's the only way I'm going to be able to sleep at night. <laughs> oh. Can't do this to me. How can I tell? Oh, rainbow. That's why he's trying to screw with me. He's trying to. Oh, he did screw with me. It's gonna be three points. Yeah, that's rare. I haven't done that in a while. All right, thank you, Percy. All right. All right. Okay. Alright, I gotta be careful that one. That's a that's an attack I probably shouldn't be using very often.
Okay, that one's a big slow one, so we just gotta hit it. I'm smarter than that. Oh, that one's... that was important. Okay, that was a rainbow one that just... Did I just get screwed by the... by the, um... Yeah, I definitely did, because they're giving me a lot of, um, rainbow ones. Did I just get screwed by the RNG? Is that all that happened? Yeah, village armor outpost. Okay, one hit KO! All attacks are four times more powerful. All items are turned off. I got it. I'm going to die a whole bunch, aren't I? Alright. Let's see if I can get them to kill each other. Yeah. They're killing each other. So whoever's left standing, I just have to fight myself. Well! I'm not here. Okay, that, and now Black Knight is the last one left. Ha ha! That was not how we play smart. Let the let the other char let the other characters kill each other, and then go after the one that's left. That was that was a good play on my part. Treasure Clash. Okay, this is just a standard Treasure Clash. I gotta I just gotta worry about that. All right. All right, I thoroughly enjoyed the whole, that whole situation. I gotta kill... Who do I gotta kill, dude? Myself. I gotta kill myself. All right, I've, I've eliminated all my competition. All right. I just gotta deal with this guy. Go for it. They dare you. Alright. Yeah, give me that. You wanna go for it? I happily encourage you going for it. Oh, he's not gonna go for it. Winning. I still won. Ha! I died and I still won. That's always a fun time. Oh, and I gotta fight Dark Priest now. Oh! Multitudes! I love the multitudes. Face twenty the same throw, luckily they're all weaker. I love that. I love multitude battles. They're my favorite. I just gotta kill a whole bunch of them, right? Yeah, they'll kill e they'll kill each other as much as they will themselves, so Well actually they're on the same team, so probably not, but
that. all dead. Alright, I have one more. There we go. Might as well pick it up. Doesn't do me much good, but I might as well. Forward! Let me guess. King Knight's my boss. Yep. Curses! The Infernal Mural lies just around the corner, and we still haven't cracked a secret. You there, Gold Armor! Yes, you, you duck-faced dunce! Get over here and do something useful for a change. No, for once, I'm going to stand up to you. Your tyrannical reign has come to an end. Treachery! Oh, don't tear my cape! Le leave me be! I am Gold Armor, and as of this day, I am lord of my own domain. I see. I, I figured they would have a rocky relationship. Okay. Come here, king. Yep. Come here, your highness. I will kick your ass. died and he killed me and then killed himself that's that's hilarious all right all right magic mirror 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 on the wall let's see what secrets you hold Yeah, a lot of a lot of show a lot of um showdowns music is recycled, but I do love the boss things for the Magic Mirror in particular. I know it's stuff. I know it's recycled stuff. I'm pretty sure it's. I'm pretty sure it's the boss theme from the Enchantress's True Form at the end of Shovel of Hope, and Know Thy True Self from the end of. What's it, what's it called? From the end of um, Spectre Torment. I died. Give me that. That's mine. I'm keeping that. Okay. Fitting! It's fitting, though, considering that gold armor was unlocked by fighting Mr. Hat, and he was my final enemy before picking up the last of the gems. That's fitting. Now the question remains. Will I be able to actually beat this guy? I can bounce on its head, on its eyeball, if I can get up there. yourself open. Yep. May actually be able to beat this guy. Because he's one of the few characters who has a jump attack, who has a downward thrust as a, as a move attack. So I may actually be able to actually hold my own against him.
Hmm. I'm close to beating him. I just need a couple more downward bounces. Okay. I'm close, so I just need to beat him. Right. Come here. There we go. And that's game. We got one more character left now. We've been we've been in the game with every character except one. All right, that's fun. That's good. We've done it. But in case, yeah, that was Gold Armor story. Not sure what gold. Not sure what his story is going. How his story is going to play out. Unlock first story mode with Gold Armor. What did he unlock? Exactly. Show up, show up. Okay, well that was the end of the. Okay, well that was the end of Gold Armor's campaign. So it seems that Gold Arm, the Gold Armors didn't exactly like working under King Knight, which I expected because King Knight is kind of an ass. He's a he's a malevol he's a bit of an ass, and he isn't very and he isn't very fun to work with. I know I've played as him. He's not very pleasant. So yeah. I'm a, I would imagine I would imagine this gold armor would def, would have defected after being treated like nothing by this guy when they went by this guy who just showed up and proclaimed himself his boss when his real boss always treated him with kindness more or less because King Primor seems like the kind of guy who would definitely be definitely um who would definitely be a bit of a um better boss than King Knight would ever be he seems like the kind of guy who would just who actually cares for his subjects. As opposed to King Knight, who treats everybody as beneath him and just looks at them like they're like they're dirt, literally. Even before he was even before he was king, he he treated everybody like dirt, and it wound up costing him all, all of his friends. So, yeah, he no longer has a he no longer has a um. So I'm assuming the gold armor no longer is go going to be to stand up for himself and finally make himself make himself worthy of being able to. To determine his own destiny, I would assume. That's what it seems like. Of course, I'm just spitballing here. I have honestly have no idea. We'll, we'll see how the story actually ends, and if I'm right or not. But, but yeah, King Knight is. But yeah, it seems like it's not everybody. Not all of the gold armors like working for King Knight, and I can understand that. So, yeah, King Knight is. So yeah, the gold armor. So yeah, I think this gold armor might actually rebel. And this one in particular will definitely rebel or something. I'm an all Kickstarter backers, you made this happen. Alright. Physics Buck CD. Yeah, and now we're at the and now I'm assuming we're getting to our totals. I do like how they list all the, the things that they use to make this game. So if you want to make something like this for yourself, they give you all the tools. Battle log. Let's see how many times I died. Show knight three times. The enchantress twice. Treasure knight fourteen times. I'm not surprised. Plague knight once. Target three times. Propeller knight zero times. Reese five times. Dark Reese three times. King knight once. Mirror fate five times. For a grand total of thirty-seven lives. Okay. Total KO count thirty-five. Time spike twenty mi twenty-one minutes fifty-one seconds seventy-nine milliseconds. I don't understand why milliseconds aren't in base six and aren't in base tens in base sixty. I don't understand that. Thank you for playing. Produced by Yacht Club Games. Okay, that's the end of the story for um, Gold Armor. So let's see how a how the end of a story plays out. I hope I'm right. I I've I've theorized a little bit, so I would hope. Gold Armor dreamed of his triumph, even as King Knight's boots echoed through the halls. Suddenly, he awoke with a start, as the gauntlet of his squad mate bopped him. Oh, it was only a dream after all. Aww. Gold Armor sighed, realizing he'd never rise up to challenge his king. It wasn't his place. And he had pledged an oath to the crown. Aww. So he thought it, so he thought it was all a dream. New custom unlocked Dragon Gold Armor! 
Well, yeah, this is a character from um, Spectre Torment. There's just this random gold armor that will that has a bit of a hard time figure that has a bit of a hard time fitting in. And as it turns out, there's a reason why he's not actually a human at all. He's a dragon with a gold armor armor. Hold on. Okay, so now I can play as dragon gold armor. That's fun. All right. Yeah, I, I can actually show that off. Um, I'll show that off. So, yeah, I can now. I now have a pallet set. Dragon Gold Armor. There he goes. There he is. Yeah, he looks badass. Doesn't he? Doesn't look like your standard Gold Armor, does he? He does. He, he, that's because he didn't. I like that. I, I really like that idea. Oh, and he gets his own pallet set as well. I think it's a reverse of what it is. I think it's a, it's it's absolutely a reverse of what their standard gold armors is. Everything it's okay. That's cool. Uh, yeah, he looks really cool. That is some cool artwork of him. I I really like the dragon armor character. He's a he's a minor character that doesn't really get as much creativity as, as much um as he deserves, but he looks really cool. Look at him! He looks amazing. He looks um, he looks he looks really cool, and I'm sad that this is the best render we get of him. He's a very minor character, unfortunately, and we don't get to see much of him. But he does exist in Shovel Knight canon, and I'm glad we get to play as him at long last. That's cool. Um, but in any case, now we've only got one character left. We got Liquid Samurai, and he is the last character on our roster before before we f officially end off the the story modes for. Shovel Knight Showdown. So, with that, I think I'm gonna leave it here. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Also, be sure to follow me on Facebook and on Twitter in the description below. And also, check out my Patreon in the description below as well. It's only a couple bucks a month. It really helps me out, and you guys get access to a bunch of cool perks. I'm always saying thanks. So, be sure to check those out in the description below as well. But, in any case, thank you guys so much for watching, and until next time, I will see you guys in the next video. Peace!